Welcome to Rally Mexico. Last time we saw the cars in the World Rally Championship, we were in Sweden. Remember Sweden? Minus 28 degrees. It was hurting, it was so, so cold. But look at this, glorious weather, glorious, glorious setting here above Leon, plus 28 degrees, expecting maybe as high as plus 30, plus maybe even 32 degrees on the rally itself. But well, as you can tell up here, a little bit of altitude, nice and breezy as well. Dust could be an issue. Have a look at what we've got here on this surface. You can see this is actually stage two. It's the first stage on Friday morning. Look at the surface. Look, get up, see the dust, see how loose it is there. That really is an issue in two areas. It's an issue with the dust, particularly early in the morning, but more so than the dust, it's an issue in terms of grip. You get off this line and look at this line here, look. Nice and clean. That's just the wrecky cars, but that's still going to cause a few problems. You come off that line, and my goodness me, that is loose indeed. That could be very, very interesting and very difficult. And we know that the Ford drivers, remember there are three Fords, one in Sweden. Uh, they'll be at the top of the stage, first on the list, if you like, first on the road. The Fords, I think, will struggle on the Friday. The other problem they're going to have, clearly, these kind of things here. Look at this rock, huge rock on the inside. You catch that, you're in all sorts of trouble. Now, as you can tell, I'm out of breath. Why am I out of breath? Because I'm an athlete, shouldn't be out of breath. It's the altitude. The altitude has the same problems with the cars. Really does sap the power from the engines. Very, very difficult indeed. So a few things to watch out for on this rally. Dear me, let me get my breath. It's ridiculous. It's an effort. A few things to look out for on this rally. One, clearly, road position. It's all about this gravel. Two, look out for these rocks on the inside. Three, the altitude. What kind of effect is that going to have on the rally cars? Let's just have a quick listen. Well, not a listen. We'll have a quick talk in a second when I get my breath back. Whew, as to who might win this one, Sebastian Loeb. He's got to be in with a good chance. Great, great road position on the Friday. Sebastian Ogier, good position as well. Peter Solberg could easily be a Citroen 1, 2, 3 here. A reversal from what we saw in Sweden. We'll find out who copes with the altitude, because it won't be me. Which cars cope with the altitude? Who's going to win this one? It's going to be a glorious weekend, whatever happens. Follow it all obviously on WRC.com, but also on iRally.